Good morning, Christian friends. This is the Plum Line. I'm Jesse Hood. Today's scripture will be Isaiah 61. The Spirit of the, of the Lord God is upon me because the Lord has anointed me to preach good tidings unto the meek. He has sent me to bind up the brokenhearted, to proclaim liberty to the captives and the opening of the prison to them that are bound. Christian friends, before we get into uh, a word of prayer and before we get into the scripture, I have exciting news, Christian friends. The plumb line has been given confirmation from my pastor, Dr. H.C. Miller. And we're going to do an initial sermon for the plumb line. It's going to be August 26, 2018, August 26, 3 p.m. at Tupper Memorial Baptist Church, TMBC. That's my church on the corner of Cabarrus and Blunt Street, 501 Blunt Street. So Christian friends, come on, come all, come and celebrate this momentous, joyous occasion. The best thing that ever happened to the plumb line in his entire life. I've had many ups in my life, and I had downs. I had doors closed in my face. But every door that closed in your face don't mean it's a denial. It means God has something better for you. Sometimes delays come in your life because God didn't have it planned for you. It was your plan. It wasn't God's plan. We thank God for open doors. We thank God for the opportunity to reach the masses plumb line. Uh, Christian friends, so come help the plumb line celebrate his initial sermon. To be a servant and preach the word, the unadulterated word of the gospel. To spread the good news. I pray, Lord, show me the way, Lord. Let me reach the masses, Father. So, Christian friends, Radio Land, We Care, Millicent, T. Mackey, the whole board, the plumb line. Really, uh, we love you guys for the opportunity for such a time as this. Tupper Memorial Baptist Church. The plumb line love you. So come one, come all, come uh, support the plumb line on his initial sermon. I need you. We need each other in the name of Jesus. So so we love you and 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 we just thank God for the opportunity to be a conduit, to be a servant, to reach the masses. To let everyone know that God loved you. He loved the meek. He loved the brokenhearted. He's going to pick you up. He's going to turn you around. And place your feet on solid and higher ground. In the name of Jesus. So we thank you for all that you have done in my life, Heavenly Father. We bless your holy name. All the listeners in Radio Land, you are blessed. You are blessed. Lift ye head up, O ye gates, even you everlasting doors. And let the King of Glory come on in. You know that King of Glory is our Lord and Savior. God Almighty. We got a son named Jesus the Christ. So we bless your holy name. All right. So come. Celebrate with us August 26, 3 p.m., Christian friends, TMBC, 501 Blunt Street, Tuckamore Memorial Baptist Church. All right. So, Christian friends, <clears throat> we just like to, to say a little word even before we get into uh, the scripture concerning about the violence that is going on in our black America. And I love America, served in the United States Army <clears throat> and a veteran. 
I love America. But black America, we are killing ourselves. Useless. Right now, useless killing. Parents, we're praying for a takeover in Chicago. Keep your child in the house. Set a curfew. We're praying for Baltimore, Maryland. Parents, we're praying for a takeover. We're wiping ourselves out. Parents, we're praying for a takeover in Cleveland and Detroit. Parents, we're praying for a takeover in Durham, North Carolina. Parents, we're praying for a takeover in Raleigh, North Carolina, the great city of Raleigh, state of North Carolina. We are killing ourselves. It's genocide. We're wiping ourselves off the map because of our young generation. If it's the millennials, we are doing it wrong, parents. We got to keep our children in. We got to take over. We got to take over. We got to take back everything the palmer worm and the canker worm has taken from us. We got to take our household back over. We got to get our children into a church base, a Bible church base, a church. We got to get them there. Parents, please. This is the plumb line. Am I begging? Yes. Am I pleading? Yes. The Bible said don't be anxious for anything. Take everything into prayer and supplication. And make your request known. Hallelujah. So, so, so we coming to you in prayer and supplication. And we're making our requests known that the God have uh, the peace that surpasses all understanding will touch our heart and our mind. Parents, please, let's get order back in our house before our young generation is wiped, slammed off the face of... We are losing too many young children, black boys and girls don't even have an opportunity to live a life of, of, of the promise that our God has promised us. Hallelujah. Parents, please. Let's get a grip. We're praying for a takeover in the name of Jesus. Heavenly Father, Hear our prayers, hear our supplications, hear our petitions. We pray for our young black children, we're our young black youth, 9 and 10 years old, who need to be at home getting gunned down 2.30, quarter to 3 in the morning. What's up with that? Where is our laurels? Where is our moral aptitude? Come on, black America. This is the plumb line. I love you. And I stand on the top of Mount Everest and proudly tell the world that I love you. And I love you, parents. But we have to do a better job in the name of Jesus. Psalms 126 and 6 says, The sun shall not strike you by day or the moon by night. Hallelujah. Psalms 121 said, We'll lift our eyes into the hills which cometh our help. And our help come from our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus. Psalms 19 and in 15, it says, Psalms 19 and 15, it says, Let the words of my mouth, hallelujah, and the meditation of my heart, thank you, Jesus, be acceptable in thy sight. O oh Lord, you are my strength and my redeemer, hallelujah. Uh, 7 Corinthians 5 and 17. Therefore, thank you Jesus, if any man be in Christ, he is a new creature. 
old things have passed away. Behold, all things have become new. Psalms 1. Blessed is the man that walketh not in the counsel of the ungodly. We can't walk with them ungodly people. We cannot sit, we cannot stand in the pathway of sinners, nor sit in the seat of the scornful. Hallelujah. But our delight is in the law of the Lord. And in that law we meditate day and night. And we're going to be just like a tree. We got to be fruitful, black America. We got to be fruitful. And we can't uh, wipe ourselves off the face of the, of the world. We're going to be just like a tree planted by the rivers of waters. And, and that fruit will bear good fruit in its season. Hallelujah. And we won't wipe each other out because our leaves will not wither. And everything, hallelujah, that we touch shall prosper. Christian friends. So I'm praying to you right now that the Holy Spirit of the Lord is upon me. And he has sent me here to preach to the meek. He has sent me here uh, to uh, preach to the anointing good tidings. Good tidings. We don't want to preach about uh, bad tidings. But we got to straighten up our act, Christian friends. We want to preach good tidings. We want to preach the good news, which is the good news of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. That we're going to uh, set the captives free. Anybody that's in bounds and chains, that's wrapped all up with all this violence, we want to set you free. Because our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, if you need to be free, he's a prison shaken savior hallelujah if you in pain he's a pain taker if you in sorrow he will give you peace hallelujah hallelujah he is our rock of ages clep for me let me hide myself in thee he's my clef he's my rock he will protect me he will get us out of the rain. He will protect us from the storm. He's my shade in my right hand. He will give us joy. He will give us hope. He will give us life. Hallelujah. He's the jasmine of my spices. He's all and all and everything's good. Hallelujah. He's the anointed one. Hallelujah. He will pick us up where we are down. He said, come to me those who are wounded and worn. And I will uh, give you rest. I'll give you peace. Come as you are. Stop all of our uh Wicked ways, Christian friends. We got to humble ourselves and pray in the name of Jesus. So we love you.